Ow. I'm okay. <laughs> Hey everyone, welcome back to another episode. This is episode 231. And if I believe, we had a turtle up there and there should still be one here. No. I see you. What are you doing? Why is he over here? Come follow me. Wait, they follow seagrass still, right? Come on. What are you doing? I want to breed my turtles because we almost have the turtle helmet, but not quite yet. Okay, there you go. Oh, good lord. Oh, lord have mercy. No, 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 hey, come on, no, here, seagrass, up, no, go, no, don't go in the water, don't, don't, no, right, I give up, today we start on the infamous training course, as you can see right over here, this is the spot I have chose, because it's reasonably flat, and it's not in the way of anything else, uh, I've already flattened it out quite a bit, as you can see, and I have no idea what it's gonna look like, I just got to my materials, I know we're going, Where's my... Oh, I thought I grabbed it. Um, how much do we have in here? We need a lot of this. Oh, we're going to need a lot of cobweb, too. Oh, no. Oh, well. Okay, here we are. Don't let this fool you. This was hours of work. <laughs> it really was. This was very hilly. Um, it went up at least that tall over there, cleared it all out, patched up the holes. It's looking good. Um, I just finished with the pathway there. I kind of followed the river, so um, I don't know. I never put a whole lot, a lot of people, well, not a lot. A few people have asked why I would just keep it simple. I really like just the path grass look, like flattened grass. I don't like putting a whole lot of detail into the path. Um, but yeah, how am I going to do this? So what I envisioned is a fence around a training <laughs> no um well that's basically it but we got to do something along those lines i want to have like a barracks and all that good stuff maybe even a cafeteria i don't know i guess i'm just going to start free handing it i guess that's what i usually do this is the crappy thing about having two storage rooms i always forget that i have so much more stuff down here i've been looking for lime look at all this hardened clay what the wait do i have like oh my gosh I've been needing gunpowder because... <laughs> oh, my God. Okay, no bones. Okay, I got a lot of... Uh, we should... Wait, what's in here? Nothing. Okay, wait. I'm interested now. Hang on. Uh, okay, I should go. <laughs> All right, let's do this. Ugh, I've been walking around forever. I kind of forget how useful these elytra wings and rockets are. Okay, so here's the road I got. I turned it right around this way. And, yeah. Oh, God. It looks weird. Uh, I don't know if I'm feeling it or not. Um, so this is the front gate we're going to have. Uh, we're going to have the cobwebs across there. There's the barbed wire fence. And eh, that thing. <laughs> oh, God, I got to work with it. It looks weird right now. Hang on. This is important. Ah, there we go. Ah. <laughs> uh, we need this guy. Because it'll help if we... Can I leash you from here? No! I can't leash you? Sorry. There we go. Alright, come here, buddy. Get in the hole. Get... Get in the hole. Get in the hole. Get in the hole. <laughs> oh my god. Would you just stop moving for a second? Just stand still. Thank you. No! Stop. Thank you. In the hole. God. Oh, God, he's getting out now. Hang on, let's put this block here, and then we will... <sighs> Hang on. No. No, I, that means I need to get down. There we go. A black rope. All that work for that. <laughs> no, no, no. Yeah, man. All right, for some of you that probably didn't see my last episode or something like that, I'm going to go ahead and mention again, I am going to be in the San Diego location for mine fair the link will be in the description if you want to know more about it um on saturday and sunday yes that's in a f in a few days oh boy <laughs> it'll be interesting um but it'll be super fun so if you're in that area come meet me anyway um i fixed it a little bit it looks it's just weird 
I don't know. <laughs> I think it's those like slabs I put on the top, but it will work for now. Um, I'm working on the fence around here, over here now, and I cleared out this spot. I like these woods right here. We're actually going to probably turn these woods into part of the training course, which will probably just be a gate leading into some dark woods that you can only go in at nighttime to fight. Um, and the thing is, the reason I built this tent, by the way, is because when we enter this training course, this is the place where we dump off all of our goods. Because we're coming in here empty, because we're probably going to die on some stuff and whatnot, because I got some pretty cool things in mind that involve lava and other traps. <laughs> and we got all this land to work with. Um, so, yeah, we're not going to... Oh, yeah. Huh. As you can see, it's all grass, but I want to implement... I would... The wind is doing that, not a chicken. <laughs> I would like to have some podzel. Did we ever get any? I need to go check. Okay, I don't think we've ever come across... Did I don't think we've ever found a mega taiga in this world yet. Which is pretty crazy to think about. But we do have these blocks, which I am going to use. Uh, brown concrete powder and coarse dirt. So this is actually going to look really good in here. Um, I think I mainly want to add a coarse dirt and spot in a few brown concrete powder. But I do want to keep some grass in some areas, but I think I mostly want it to be that coarse dirt. Because it just looks rugged and like there's been a lot of running on it. Which means we're going to need a lot of it and... Oh gosh, that's a lot of digging. <laughs> and the 4 to 4 scale map is finished. Would you look at that? This little map in my hand shows the same amount of space as my giant map underground. <laughs> Power went out again. Oh, all better. All right. God, that's so weird. Look at this. I just can't stop looking at this. You can see it. Like, if I line it right there, it looks identical. And then over here, oh, my gosh. And my plan is is to make a 3 by 3 map wall with the 4 to 4 scale maps. And then I think I would, this one would stay here because that's just my normal map. This one's a 2 to 2 scale. I'll replace this one with these. Because it's outside where we walk past it every day. <laughs> okay, it looked cool in the beginning. But now it just looks crazy weird. I want to find a different place for our bamboo farm. <laughs> okay, I was running around trying to find a place to put this bamboo. And then I thought of something. Whoa, I haven't done this in a while. Hey! Oh, jeez. Uh, I think the last time I did that, I killed myself. Okay, <laughs> I came over here. Oh, this snow needs to go away. Looks weird. And look at this. What if we did... Okay, uh, let's take this down for a second. Nope, nope, we don't need any more snow here. Sorry, dude. Oh, yeah. All right, now... <laughs> why did I... Oh, this is gra... Wait, it can be placed on sand. Yeah, it can. Oh, it's off-centered. Hopefully that won't make it look... Well, actually, no. No, I don't want to die. Gosh, I hate this crafting system. All right, let's see if this makes it look strange or better. Oh my gosh. Well. Huh. You know what? It looks it looks good. Oh my gosh, I can't this is a tough decision. Okay, this is thinner and that's brown and I think in real life they're more brown than green. Oh, but I like the the leaves coming off up there. That makes it look so much Oh my gosh. What do you guys think? <laughs> Let me know down below. I can't... Oh, man. I don't know which one to use. Obviously, we have to keep those ones with those over there. The crooked ones. Or maybe we can just have a few like that. Oh, my gosh. Why is this a tough decision? It looks so good. Yeah, I put that back to normal. But then I dotted those back there, and now it just looks weird. And now I'm annoyed because I don't know what to do. Looky there. I'm just going to go ahead and plant them here for now, just a few, because I actually think I want these to be in the factory, uh, so we can actually have the factory growing stuff and actually make it useful. We are back. I am back, specifically me. Uh, and I tried to get this video out before the Mind Fair event, but I couldn't. I only recorded like half, and well, that's why I didn't upload uh, this or a Let's Play for a little bit, uh, but I met so many of you. It was so awesome. If you didn't know, I went to Mine Fair in San Diego, my first Minecraft event ever in my life, and it was awesome. And I met, like I said, so many of you guys, and I, ho I hope to do it again. 
sometime in the future. Who knows? Uh, but uh, we're back in the Let's Play. And, um, well, what did we do last? Oh, yeah, we were working on the, uh, the training course. I so badly want to work on it now, but, um, hmm. But we're going to do something different. Oh, lordy. Uh, ah, uh. ah. <laughs> we're gonna be mining we haven't gone mining down here in a long time and I just want to get restocked oh gosh oh no I think <laughs> most of my diamonds are up in my uh, vault am I good to go I have a lot of stuff on but whatever I just want to mine for a little bit I've been wanting to for a while uh, we haven't been down here in a while as well um, oh yeah I used to put the signs on these I should probably wait when did I mine this one someone got lazy uh, What's going on in here? What are you guys doing? I'm just going to start mining here and just see if we can find anything interesting. Oh, looky there, iron. So if you guys didn't catch my last video I uploaded, it was uh, called Will Hightail Be Better Than Minecraft? And, well, I kind of just did that to s make you guys click on Is that what clickbait is? <laughs> no. no. Um, I, I kind of had an intention on the name there, but um, I just want to talk about that for a minute because... A lot of you think that I'm just going to probably play that and never play Minecraft again because I was super hyped about it, but I'm definitely going to upload both. We don't even know when that is coming out quite yet. All we know is that the beta may come out in this year. Hopefully soon, though, but the reason I'm just so excited for it is because you guys know I love the adventure side in Minecraft. That's why I started the Minecraft adventure and the Nomad series, but it's just so hard to execute in Minecraft for some reason. I don't know why. Just something about this game in particular is all about, it's more on the building side rather than adventuring. They haven't quite nailed the adventuring side yet. But Hytale, that looks like all about adventuring. The dungeons, the cool landscapes, the hunting monsters and all that. And that's why I think when that game comes out, that will actually be our adventure series. I'm going to start, If I'm sure there's going to be a survival aspect to it, like a survival just like this game and that is what we are going to play when it comes out is just a strict survival series where we just explore an adventure and we're going to build and stuff like that but um uh, we're not going to stop on minecraft anytime soon <laughs> well uh no diamonds all right old buddy you need to stop getting stuck here. It's kind of annoying. That's how I do it, right? Yeah, thank you. No, 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 no. No, no. And he's gone. That's not good. Um. Uh, where are you going? Why is he... Okay, here. <laughs> Just stop moving. I don't want him to get away. He's he's the house guard. He stays in the house. Ha! Ah! Oh, God, George. That scared me. <laughs> Get in. Now. Now. Thank you. Oh, my lord. God, George is such a troublemaker, man. Okay. I want to try something. So, let's get rid of these here. These have been here for a little bit. Don't really need them here. <laughs> um, we need to take down the Christmas tree, too. I'll probably just do that in between episodes. Uh, Blue, how you doing? Where's my cats? Uh, oh, well. All right. So, here's our first fish we ever caught in a bucket here. Um, this is gonna be Sammy the Salmon, <laughs> and he's been there for a while. I'm surprised he's not dead somehow. But this right here is going to be our new fish tank because it used to be our old mob spawner elevator. If you did not know, if you're new here, as you can see, I already turned the elevator part. What? I already turned the elevator part into a fish tank. But those are going to be our random tropical fish. This fish tank up in the house is going to be our fishes that we catch and that are special to us. So. Uh, first off is going to be Sam and Sam. I don't know where he came from. Oh, he's dead. Yeah, he can't be put in there anyway. So I need to clog up that. And then other than that, that should be all. And just fill it up with water. There we go. Um, get some more of this up in here. And by the way, if this video is uploaded late, that means I decided to upload two videos in a day. And I'm going to try to upload a lot this year. That is my main goal. Um, so... That might mean videos might have to be shorter, though. So don't be surprised if you start seeing, like, 15 to 20-minute videos. But that would be better to have videos every day, wouldn't it? Instead of just, like, uh, mm, do I want that there? No, wait. I want I want that to be glass. I think that would look better. 
Would it? Yeah, sure, why not? Glass. Well, white stained glass I have to do, because that's all I got. Uh, these can go, finally, and start filling this place up. So, will I just want to place it up here? Well, yeah, I assume so. And then there. That won't make it all flow, right? I don't know. We'll see. All right. Uh-oh. Wait a minute. Oh, no. Uh, we have a leak outside. I accidentally placed it on the slab. Go out! Jeez. Ooh. Uh, now how did that happen? What? What on earth is going on? Oh, I placed that one on the slab too. Jeez, this, I hate the new water mechanics with these blocks. It's so silly. Like, you know what I mean? Because... What if you want to, like, do what I'm doing here and not flood something? Yeah, I don't like the whole water block, I mean, water log system. What on earth? Stop it. Go away. Bad. Uh, how am I? Ah! Uh, what the? Uh, I got an idea. Place. Get out of here. All right, and then grab that. Cool. That was more difficult than it should have been. All right, so place on... The sides. The sides. The lead. The lead. The lead. The lead. The lead. That's SpongeBob, you know. <laughs> Boom and. Bo oh gosh, what? I don't like that. What is that? Why is water so weird? Is that a little air pocket? Oh, it is. Look at that. It's a... Oh, wait. No, it's not. Okay. I thought my bubbles were going down. But that's just me drowning. Okay. Now we got this all filled up with water. Is this a water pocket? It is. That's cool. All right. So, uh, how does it look on the outside? I didn't get a good look. Okay. It's kind of dark. Okay. I want some sea pickles in there first. All right. Let's hope you can place sea pickles on anything like, well, just anything. Like, yeah, you can. Okay. I want to do full four because that is the lightest... One, two, three. Uh, that's all I got. <laughs> Stolen from my river. I'm going to have to go get some more. Now, um, I'm going to decorate this fully. I don't know what else you can put in there. It is kind of weird seeing water in there, though, you know? Because, you know, <laughs> it's bad. Water's bad for wood. I don't care, though. All right. Sammy the Salmon. All right. Let's get you going. Now, do I have... I do. Okay, let's go ahead and... You can name fish, I hope, right? I hope so. He won't despawn, probably, but it just makes me feel better knowing that there will be a name tag on him. So, we'll just call him, uh, Sammy. Man, Sammy, you've been trapped in here for a while. Are you finally happy to go free? Here we go. Hey! Thank you. Remember, I've been trying to get that achievement. There he is. Oh my gosh, you're a biggin. Sammy, get over here. Jesus. Sammy, <laughs> look how big he is. Oh, my Lord. Oh, please tell me he can go up there, right? What is he doing? Oh, he's stuck on the pickles. All right. Uh, let's put the pickles right over here. Oh, my God. I just want to get through and see how big he is. Like, swim. Oh, that's cool. Yeah, I like that. Oh, that's hot. <laughs> no. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, dude, why is he so big, though? Salmon don't really get that big, you know? I think that's a bug right now or something, but... Now we have an indoor aquarium. And the more fish we get, we can fill it up. They have to be special fish, though. In today's comment question of the day, I hear George. Hi, George. Are you finally free? Happy to be free? Whoa. That's weird. All right, anyway. Um, today's comes from two people. First one is from underscore viewer. Did you play Red Dead Redemption 2, and did you enjoy it? Thank you for another question about other games. Uh, I like talking about other games because, I'm, a, as, as you know, I'm a big gamer outside of Minecraft. Well, not so much anymore, actually. I've been kind of slowing down. But that's just because so much is going on. But yes, indeed I did. And did I enjoy Okay, yes. And did, yes, I did play and I did enjoy it. It was it's probably in my top ten games right now. Um, I played the whole story until, like, chapter six. And then I restarted because I didn't like the road it was going. Okay. Yeah, I'm, I want to talk about it. So 
Uh, spoilers ahead if you did not beat Red Dead Redemption 2. Um, but yeah, the game was phenomenal. It was like so different from all the other like games that have been coming out. It's very Witcher 3 like, and you guys know I'm a big Witcher fan. Um, it was basically, I like to put it Witcher 3 in just like Western times. Um, but the amount of stuff you can do in that game, the fishing, the hunting, it was unreal. And the storyline was so good. But, like I said, spoilers are coming. Um, when you got to like chapter 5, Arthur got sick of tuberculosis, which is a bad disease when you're back in those days because you couldn't treat it, just resting treated it. But, uh, and then. It started getting really depressing and stuff because I loved Arthur and then he was dying. And then I, I, it got spoiled for me that he does end up dying and you play as uh, John Marston. Um, and then I stopped there. I was like, I want to play it again when it's all happy and stuff because I love Arthur. So I restarted it, but then I didn't play it anymore because I already knew it was all going to happen and whatnot. And I didn't. I might play it again in the future, though. And I grew Arthur's beard out to like level level 9 or 10, which is insane, goes down to like your belly button. And I thought that was a really cool mechanic in the game. As you know, Witcher 3 brought that first, growing your beard out, and I love that in video games. Um, but yes, I did enjoy it. It was pro It's in my top 10 game list now. Um, thank you for your question. Uh, what's the next one? <laughs> From Nolan Castle. Hey, my nephew's named Nolan. Dallas, is it easy to do what you love? I thought that was an interesting question. Yes. <laughs> no. Um... It is if it's not too difficult to achieve. Like this, I love playing Minecraft. But it's not easy sometimes, you know, because you're like forced to upload now. You're not necessarily forced by hand, but you're forced to when you want to make people happy and whatnot. Like I would not be uploading this world if I didn't record it probably. This world would have been long gone by now if I didn't upload this type of world. But um the more I play it, the more I realize it is getting easier to upload. I think you just have to be really having fun in your world. If you're like forcing yourself to do these projects that you don't really want to do, then it's not really that easy. But since I love this world so much, it is pretty easy to do what I love. And I hope it is for you guys too. Um, so guys, thank you for your questions and thank you for watching. If you watch all the way to the end like this, comment... Um, Sammy. Just say Sammy. Okay? Yeah, that's all. I just want to know who watches to the end, you know? You know you. You. Yes, you. You watching right there. Little little Timmy. Is your name Tim? No, probably not. <laughs> uh, but yeah, thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys in the next episode of something. Something special, maybe. We'll see. Thank you for watching. Bye-bye.